the position where one claims as us that uh, he had the right or he had the authority or he had the, position, the privilege of getting one into the positions and, and therefore must assert all authority over the person. Political authority is very unfortunate. And I think that is the root cause of the whole thing. No, I have not had any personal conversation with him, but we tried to reach at the point of them. We tried to reach, to talk to them, but it's not been po very possible. It's not been possible to reach at any of them. Political structures have always existed. They've always existed. It depends on what extent. All former politicians have structures. And when you leave office, of course, over the years, these structures result into other structures, and it's a continuous process. So you cannot say you have a structure and it's permanent and it stays permanent. No. It's a work in progress. It's good. That is why younger ones come out. It's from these structures the younger ones get trained, you know. So uh, I wouldn't say I had structures. Well, I had structures. I wouldn't say when I leave that my structure should remain at the judge's structure. It should be structures grown and developed from the political root, you know, that stretches over the period. I'm going to quote the last paragraph of your statement. Yes. It reads as follows. As the oldest former governor of River State, I call on all former governors and their deputies to close ranks, come together, and collectively and frankly speak to our younger colleagues in the best interest of the state. End of quote. Other former governors like you, have they reached out to you? Have you sat down with them? Have you even discussed? with regards to moving the state forward and dousing this political crisis, Your Excellency? Now, we are hoping that after the first presidential in the president's intervention in this matter, and there was calm in it, that things will stabilize. And things did appear to stabilize. But after some time, statements, actions, and so on, things started moving from one extreme to the other. We are hoping that will be able to get the, all our former colleagues together. And I believe that when we do it, we, we, sh we shall do very soon, we'll be able to talk to ourselves, talk to them, they must maintain status quo, the position of the law, whatever the law says. From there, we'll be able to. So I was hoping that immediately I would reach out to all former governors, all to all my former colleagues, deputy governors, and get them, get all of us to sit together and address our younger ones. These are younger to us, which they should be able to listen to the voice of those who are better experienced, better qualified in this. I think I'm sure they should they will pay attention to what we might advise them to do based on what we meet on the ground. The, Purported impeachment of the governor, I could not understand because the governor and the members of the House of Assembly came in based on the same ticket and the same ballot. And they've spent barely up to five months. They started for afterwards, the impeachment procedure was initiated by members of the House. And members of the House who have only spent five months under five months as the governor, I wonder how the reasons and the reasons why they are initiating these procedures, I, I could not understand. I've not been able to appreciate. Is it gross misconduct? Gross misconduct. In what way? Under five months. <laughs> under five months. The same election that brought them brought the governor. Under five months, they've been able to find a lot of uh, gross misconduct. Well, 
you cannot come them until probably we hear them out individually. They should be able to spell out to reverse people what those gross misconducts are and to what extent they have taken steps to talk among themselves or to report to their party elders about it. But generalizing and saying gross misconduct is kind of here now there. And I'm not ready to enter into any judgment, but I believe it was too early to use that general pronouncement gross misconduct without specifying, notifying the people of River State, the people who voted them into power. What are those? What are those gross misconduct? <laughs>